Good morning, Pastor Steve. Freely given grace. John 1.17, For the law was given by Moses, but grace and truth came by Jesus Christ. What if Jesus was, as we said last time, just full of grace and truth and just kept it? We'd all be in trouble. But he didn't. He preached the truth to the people, and he gave great grace to those who needed it most. I think I love the story of the woman in, in John chapter 8 that was taken in adultery. There, the picture of all of us is shown. On the one hand is the guy who was also caught in the act. You know, he was faced with truth that day, but it doesn't seem that he got grace. But as she lay on the ground in front of the Savior, and as he said those words, and I wonder uh, if the guy was standing there, by the way. You know, let the one who was without sin, the one who's never lusted in your heart, let that one throw the first stone. And the convicted who were faced with the truth departed the Savior, the only one who could offer the next step. But that dear woman, and I like how he addressed her, woman, where are your accusers, right? You know what, in chapter 3, that's how he addressed his mother, woman. The same tenderness as he had for his mother. Woman, where are your accusers? Does no one condemn you? And then grace, the same grace that could have been received by those other sinners standing around if they'd chosen to avail themselves of it. And he said, she said to him, no, Lord, none. And then she got it. She looked at him and she knew him for who he was. And then imagine the feeling of truth that washed over her soul as Jesus, God of the flesh, said, neither do I condemn you, now go and sin no more. Grace forgave her and grace enabled her to not sin. But what if he was full of grace and truth and just kept it? You have been freely given this grace. What if you, what if you decide to just keep it? You, you ponder that, Pastor Steve.